How to Address a Wedding Invitation to an Unmarried Couple. Hello, and welcome to Video Jug. You finally found the perfect location for your wedding. You set the date. You even set the menu. It's all smooth sailing from here, right? Not exactly, because now you have to properly address your invitations. Traditional wedding address etiquette is very precise. But don't worry, we will help you through this sometimes confusing process and still get to the ceremony on time. You will need your wedding guest list with addresses, a new name and address list with the proper wording, and a calligrapher or business which does machine calligraphy. Step 1. Determine the status of your guest. Are they married? Do they live together? Is either one a doctor? Does either one have a PhD? It's essential you know the answers to these questions. Step 2. Determine the outer envelope address. Okay, they are unmarried. They don't live together and are not doctors. So on the outer envelope, that's the one the postman will see, you'll address it to the friend to whom you are closest. So if you are closest to the woman in the couple, you would address it Miss or Ms, her first name, her last name. And remember, no matter how nicely addressed and pretty the invitation is, it will not get there if you send it to the wrong address. So make sure you have the right address. Step 3. Determine the inner envelope address. Now it's time to address the inner envelope which holds the actual wedding invitation. This time you will include both names of the couple, in two lines. On the first line you will address it Miss or Ms and her last name. On the second line you will address it Mr and his last name. Step 4. Take the list to your calligrapher to print. When you have finished with your address list, all you have left to do is give it to your calligrapher to address the envelopes. If the cost of hand calligraphy is an issue, keep in mind that many stationery shops offer machine calligraphy, which looks very similar to hand calligraphy, but costs much less. Done. Congratulations! Your invitations will soon be in the mail, and all you have to do now is continue the real wedding planning.